Oh, lots to do, almost moved in. The piece of resistance. Here it is, folks. This is what I've been working on. I'll go over the room really quickly. Best purchase so far of the new house. Swivel chair to see all the aquariums. Vornado fan to move. I, this is not, I bought that. This is very expensive for a stupid little fan. May go back, but dehumidifier. Gonna shift this down. Gotta go return a sink that was broken from Home Depot. You have to take a break with the Kit Kat. Um, Lone Depot or hose? Wow. <laughs> What did I just say? Lone Depot or Lowe's? <laughs> Home Depot or Lowe's, whatever you choose. I do go to both. But Liam was playing video games in here while I was working yesterday. We jumped in early. We did the floors. I'm going to pop a hole in this wall at some point for a portable AC uh, because it does need to happen in here. It's about 97 degrees outside right now. Outside. We got the, we got the six lights here. And... It's 84.7 with 49% humidity. This is perfect. Have that running at comfort level. Got to figure out the garage door, insulate it, the whole thing. There's just one area where we need to fix. And um, yeah, clean that up, cover it. Not sure what I want to do with these. Maybe put a false wall and I could take this off and have that. I, I don't know. I don't know yet. But lots to do. Lots of stuff to do and lots of plants to grow with that refugium light from Kessel. Ah, but the moment you've all been waiting for, yes, this is a custom aquariums amphibious tank, paludarium. Yes, this is a sponsored video in a sense because guess what folks? This whole room will be custom aquariums. Yes. This whole room will be custom aquariums. Um, I'm sorry. It's kind of a, an emotional piece. Um, I'll get to that in a second. But you folks know how I roll. Universal rocks, universal rocks. This is actually a bowl for reptiles, uh, zoos, whatever the case is. It holds water. It's got foam underneath. I drilled it, dropped my protective layer, threw over the ABG mix from Josh's Frogs. Shout out to them. They just have supplies that are easy to get. I enjoy their service and I enjoy the people. New background, called cave. I've got a hole I can punch out, bang. I'm gonna put some moss here, little Serpa uh, inspiration. Variegations coming in nice. I did the silicone. I'm actually using a new silicone now. It's a uh, Gorilla Glue Industrial adhesive once it cures it's inert all of the plants were transferred from the vision cages um, everything everything was reused from an aquarium or escape at some point i got the reef bright ready to get rocked on this was crazy this is why it was crazy i bought all my fittings note to self make sure you got the right fittings i bought schedule 80 from uh, bulk reef supply and I mean, I think I spent like 200 something bucks on all these supplies and turns out I was a dummy and didn't measure the holes. So my bad, but custom aquariums came through in the clutch. They gave me the information I need. I just had to get schedule 43 quarter instead of schedule 80. That's my fault. Uh, leveled the stand. Everything's good. Um, the problem with getting the bulkheads though was holiday weekend moving, uh, bullfrogs, pool and spa, Gordon, a guy I've known a while. He's into fish. He's got some businesses running around locally. He had some stuff I needed. So we had thread thread for the top two. I want thread thread for all of them, but whatever. So thread thread just means I can thread everything in because I already bought it. So I had to get some slip, then thread. So PVC, slip with thread, boom, attach my barbs. Now we're cooking, we'll fill it up today. This was fun. I'll jump to the other side before I conclude what we're gonna be talking about. Literally put adhesive in silicone over pond foam after it cured, easy. Dabbed it with the ABG, dropped the plants in. This piece I've been waiting to use. Kind of rolls out into the water. The water level will be here. The frogs will be able to come up. This will trail in the water. The frogs will be able to get out. Um, I'm not telling you what type of frogs yet, but yeah. This thing is lit. 
Custom aquariums, custom designed for me. Two side doors, full front viewing panel. I'm so ready. I'm so ready. Life takes some crazy turns, folks. And I mean crazy. Didn't know if I was going to close on this house. I didn't. Paid for a friend to come all the way over to help move. Didn't know if it was going to happen. Um, just a lot of stuff went into play. Oh, I'm so grateful for everything. Um, I'm going to drop you into the tank so you can see where I drilled. I adhered the two inch PVC. Looks good. We're going to drop some sand and then, yeah, I'm so thankful for this room. I really am. I'm very, very thankful. Very thankful. I'm going to tell you something. Um, I didn't know if I was going to close. I've had a lot of stuff happen in life. Um, I mean, ever since I was a kid. And I always give more than I take. Always, always, always. And uh, I work, I, I can say I work very hard. There are days where I'm lazy just like everyone, but I work very hard. But there's one thing that I learned and it's persistence and perseverance. Um, I needed a lot of that. So thank you all so much. For yeah, thank you all so much. I had to stop because it's intense. Custom Aquariums, thank you for taking the chance on me. And now I, have, I don't have a 100,000, 300,000, 10 million subscribers. You're taking a chance on me. Carib C, a chance on me. I mean, CJ took a chance on me. My whole life I have given 100% of me into something. And there wasn't many times where I got a return on that investment. Some would say it's poor investing. I say it was building a future. I had to. I had to deposit more than I withdrew and it has, it has come to fruition right now, September of 2021. I have a beautiful home, a beautiful family, friends, you folks watching these videos. It's wild. And I've never, I never thought any of this would happen. Thank you so much for watching these videos. Thank you for your support on this journey. We're about to kick it up. How another level. Does anybody know where that's from? Leave it in the comments. I've got to run to Home Depot. I've got to get donuts for Liam. I've got to be a dad, a husband, and I get to be me. I'm on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook. If you're having trouble, I'm here. Persistent, perseverance, you will prevail. That's the three Ps. That's actually my three Ps. I'm coining it right now. Persistence, perseverance, prevail. With persistent perseverance, you shall prevail. I'm almost where I want to be. We got some work to do. It's hard. It's tough. And a lot of times it ain't fun. I'll see you on the flip side and on the next one. You know what's next.